Hi there, welcome my dear students. In this lecture, I am going to teach you how to download the WinRAR software and how to do how to compress a file or create a zip file and how to extract a zip file using WinRAR. So first of all, what you have to do, you have to open a browser in your computer or in your laptop. That can be Google Chrome, that can be Mozilla Firefox, that can be Safari, or that can be any other browser, whatever we like. I like Google Chrome. So here you can click and you can type like WinRAR and download and hit enter. After that, you will see a lot of links here. So what you can do, you can go on https www.win.raw.com. So you can right click at here and you can open this in new tab. Here, uh, WinRAR have two versions. One is the paid one and one is the free one. And uh, we are going to download the free one. If you want to download the uh, licensed one, you can click on the buy WinRAR and you can choose the payment method and you can pay for the WinRAR and you can download the paid version. So I'm going to download the uh, not paid version I'm going to download the free version from here and in the free version or in the paid version we have two type of option 32 bit and 64 bit it's up to you you want to download the 32 bit version software or you want to download the 64 bit uh, version software mm -hmm. so what I'm going to do uh, my laptop my computer is 64 bit so what I'm going to do my I have Windows 10 and uh, I'm going to download the uh, 64 bit version I, I will click here this will take me to another page on this page I have again they are giving me option uh, for downloading the pirate one license one or the free one I'm going to click on the down uh, on the free one when I'm going to click on the free one this is going to take me on onto another page and my downloading download is start here so I have downloaded this before uh, I have just downloaded this again for you guys and uh, here uh, there is one case uh, there they are giving you a message here they are saying thank you for downloading WinRAR if your download doesn't start within five seconds click here to download the WinRAR so uh, just wait for five to ten seconds or for 30 seconds if your download didn't start automatically you can uh, click on this button here where you can see a hand uh, hand picture over here you can uh, click here and this is going to download uh, this is going to start your downloading for the WinRAR software by forcefully so in here you can click on show in folder and if you click on it you will get get a uh, explorer open and here you will uh, see the options of WinRAR I have downloaded it two times so what you can do uh, you can just double click on the software and this will give you a pop-up or maybe uh, this is going to give you a warning just click on yes on that warning that is asking your asking from you uh, like administration permissions like uh, are you sure you want to download this in your laptop a kind of message I have disabled that message I didn't exactly remember that message so what you have to do uh, you have to click on install but before installation I want to tell you something uh, here you can see this is saying that destination folder in the destination folder here it's saying that C program files WinRAR this is the default location of installing this software in your laptop or in your computer so here uh, if you don't want to go into the default location you can click on browse and you can choose whatever the path you want in the PC if you have like two drives or one drive wherever you want to install the software it's up to you but I recommend my recommendation is go with the default option just click it's very simple the installation is very simple what you can do you can click on install and after that this will take few seconds this will take few seconds and this will give you a page like this one by default you will see the options like this and after that here you will see an option like add WinRAR to desktop and the second option is add WinRAR to start menu so I'm not going to click on the add WinRAR to desktop but I want to add WinRAR to start menu what is start menu this is your start menu so I want to add my WinRAR here uh, into the start menu for a quick shortcut after that what you have to do you just have to click on okay after checking this box if you want if you want uh, 
a shortcut on your desktop you can click on you can check box this uh, box and uh, I want my desktop clean if you want to have a shortcut on your desktop you can check this box after that you can click on ok and you will see an other pop-up like this one like WinRAR has been successfully installed to the folder and it's also giving you a destination where your WinRAR has been installed so that's it done you can click on done and after that a folder like this is going to open you can just simply uh, close this uh, window and the next thing I'm going to explain you about the WinRAR like what is the benefit of WinRAR and how to use that and why we are going to use the WinRAR there are maybe there are more other software because but uh, in the past from the past few years I'm using the WinRAR so give me just one second let me pull up my folders that I'm going to show you some step So here uh, I have created a folder with the name of one touch tab and inside here what I have to do I'm going to create a new folder you can right click on here and here you can click on folder and you can call this any name I I'm going to call this folder underscore one whatever you like you can give the name here and after that you have to hit enter and inside that uh, you can create more folders if you wish or you can create files again right click goes go here and click and click on create a new text document and here you can give him uh, give this document name anything whatever you like for example testing doc dot txt or you can do one more thing you can create another document if you are familiar with web development for that purpose I'm going to create a new document with the name of index.html and this is giving me a warning that are you sure you want to change the file type I'm going to say that yeah go on change my file type and I'm going to say yes and here can you see I have two files here I'm going back one folder here now I'm going to teach you how to create a zip file or a RAR file you can click on here right click on here here you will see multiple options like add to archive add to folder dot RAR compress and the email we are not going to use that and compress to folder folder underscore one dot RAR and email I'm not going to use that so what I'm going to do that you can use add to archive or you can use the add to folder dot RAR or you can send to compress zip file so I'm going to click on that this is going to create a file a zip file for me within millisecond so you can use this file to you can send this file into emails if you are going to upload your folder or if you, or your files directly into the email as an attachment that is going to give you an error like this is a this is a virus or some that kind of stuff for that purpose you need to upload your uh, your files to a drive and after that you can use that I will show you later on in some other video but today uh, my f uh, video is related to WinRAR so what what you have to do next after that uh, let's suppose I'm going to delete this one folder for now so if you double click on this folder you will see a uh, you will see a folder like this uh, pop-up uh, input or a window like this what you can do you can simply hold on this one with the uh, with the left click and you can drop that here if you drop that here your files are extract and there is one more thing there is another for uh, there there is an other method by using that you can extract the files so for that purpose what you have to do you can again right click on here and you can say extra extract files if you do extract files this is going to extract your folder here so if you do extract to folder this is going to create a new folder here and inside that folder this is going to create a folder uh, inside that like let, let me show you how uh, it's a little bit confusing let me show you a visual for that one if I click on this one can you see this uh, this have created a new folder inside that folder I have my zip file if I come back again if I delete this one again and if I extract the files here extract here I'm sorry here can you see that I have only th 
the one folder the exact that I have I have on the beginning so this is the uh, video about the WinRAR how to use that how to download that how to install in your system and uh, how to zip the files how to extract them and how to create zip and there is one more thing at the end before leaving if you click on start menu here you can see the WinRAR you can open the WinRAR from here as well so that's it about the today lecture also you in the next video take care bye bye